So boys, it's a little chilly this morning, eh? It's so, it's 24 degrees and it doesn't look like it since it's sunny, but it is so cold. Our water froze. Our water froze. Yeah, it did freeze pretty good. Ah. Yeah, it stayed, stayed nice warm last night. Man, it's freezing we though. We have cracked it over there, but over here. Okay, don't down. get all muddy, please. All right, yeah, you're gonna get in the car. Yeah. So that's a good morning to go to breakfast. So we're going to a place here, um, some place. Food for Mom. thought. Food for thought. You should think Mom. about that. You what? should think. I'm Jesus walking in the river. <laughs> what day is this? It's Saturday. Yeah. Good Saturday to you. So it's um, 24 degrees. Yes. Or colder. Uh, here, well, how cold is it where you're at? Let us know in the comments. I'd like to know. If you're back in San Diego, it's probably 90, degrees. 80 degrees. Yeah. Although it doesn't, it feels like Christmas out here. That's the thing that I love. It really feels like Christmas. If for Christmas you freeze to death. Anyways, we're heading to uh, breakfast, and then I don't know what the plan is the rest of the day, but it should be a good one. We're we're uh, not really doing much today. We got to clean up. Daniel's got some. Danielle's got some work to do. She's cleaning the house and I gotta clean out the car and do a little editing work. Cause then her parents are coming tomorrow. Her dad and then uh, her parent, her mom, the rest uh, later this week. So getting ready for them and you know, another week of not doing much, which I love. All right, we're off. Get ready for the cold, watch her face when she feels the cold. There it was. There, oh boy, Ooh, testy. Oh no, the doors. Oh yeah, I know. Isn't that crazy? I feel it. Look at that little snowflakes and things. Looks like. Erica, the doors froze. Oh, All right. Yeah, but your jacket holds down to like 20 degrees though. That's. Oh, this thing fell off. Oh my gosh, we need to vacuum. See, you can see why we need to vacuum out the car. All right. Well, that all right, what does it say it is? Oh, it's well 28, so it's warmed up a lot this morning. All right, gang, you ready? Yes, wait, this line. It's funny passing these other RVs as we drive out of our a temporary RV park and seeing people's decorations. Like, people go all out on their uh, RVs and trailers and things, and we did, like, a pretty darn good job. How was decorating the trailer compared to a home? What is, what is he thinking? What is he thinking? That's crazy. He's like outside cooking bacon. It's funny to me that how many people camp in the winter. Like yeah, there's quite a few people here. Oh, that's right. It's Saturday. Yeah, but compared to last week, this place is empty. Yeah, but it's still filled up yesterday. Yeah. I'm just surprised. Yeah, it is funny. People will come here just for the weekends. We call them weekenders. That's funny. And uh, here's our trail that we run on every day. But uh, yeah, people will just show up for like a couple of days. The weekend. For yeah, yeah, it is. That's, yeah, that's true. Just for Christmas. I know. But they bring like the funny thing about the people who come just on the weekends is they bring so much stuff. Like they spend. They have like a wood Christmas tree in there. You see that? Oh, look at that! Like, that's cool. cool. But they'll spend like all of Saturday getting all of their stuff unloaded and like ready to go, and then Sunday they'll spend a couple hours enjoying it and then it's time to pack up and leave but they'll bring like unbelievable amounts of stuff and you can tell the people who do this full time because they don't have much stuff at all it's just crazy like they have a tent trailer. oh wow that's crazy. crazy look at that thing cool. like all right well that's the end of our saturday video just wanted to put a little something out on our way to breakfast on the east coast i i do think though that when we get back to the west coast i've always been a Never been a morning person, always stayed up late and slept in because uh, I work late. But I'm switching that and I feel like going back to the West Coast, I'm going to be like up early. There's been so many people parked here the last few days. I wonder, are they doing something inside? Yeah, really. I don't know. Maybe they rent the They're thing not. out. Oh, I bet so on the weekend. Yeah. I bet they do a family thing. Yeah, yeah. probably. That makes sense. All right. That's the end. All right, well, we made it to our favorite little breakfast place here in Williamsburg. Actually, we've never been here for breakfast, but I bet it's going to be our favorite breakfast place. And uh, the problem now is just finding parking. This place is called Food for Thought, and we ate here for, I think, dinner one time. 
and uh, and enjoyed it uh, a lot. So we thought, let's try it for breakfast. But I don't see no parking. So it says you can park over at Ripley's Believe It or Not, which is next door. But I, uh, I you have to go out to the street to get there. So I'm just going to see if there's parking here. And uh, let's see if these people look at me weird holding them. Now, the one thing about... And there's a lot of things about Virginia that we've learned that we like, good things, but uh, people will just park anywhere in Virginia. Like, if there's a dirt lot, like I'm gonna show you right here. Oh, there is parking back here, good. Uh, there's quite a lot of parking. Oh, well, that's nice, that's nice. But see over here, I don't know if you can see those cars. Um, they, there's, those aren't parking lots uh, up there, up there. They're just parked on dirt because there's dirt up there. And we've noticed that almost everywhere we go, if there's no parking, but there is like just, you know, an empty spot, they'll just park there. And, uh, and I kind of like that. All right. Well, we're going to go in. Uh, so happy Saturday to you. Hope you have a good one. Yeah. Yeah. Bye. Good night.